Hi, welcome again to a five minute revit. Today, tips and tricks is about to create a space frame. A space frame like that, we have here already a family based pattern or panel based pattern. If I click tab and select this one, it is really a family uh, based up pattern. Okay. And how we, uh, if, if I select the whole things and I will put no pattern, you see here, it is only this uh, surface that I divide it. Okay. We have already in another video about, uh, adaptive component. We seen before how to create this thing. Okay. It's only a surface. Then it's divided with pattern. And then we have, uh, like if I select the whole thing stop like that and I click like that you if you see this family like we have in the beginning okay that's easy I will just click tab and select this one and edit family the whole things it's based on this uh, family okay let's see how it's work from scratch okay I will close everything right now i will close this one and i will create a new family i go here and i go select here a family based panel based pattern okay where is it that's it okay curtain panel pattern based open now i got this a little grid okay we have here this four okay for um, point i will click here to add another four point okay i will select set and i will sit here and click here i will set the work plan this small one and click the same i will repeat it for the rest okay the same for the rest okay easy and quick okay now escape couple of time i will select the whole thing here i go for my filter here check none and select a reference point okay this one okay now i select the reference point i will give them here a parameter okay i will click here and i name it offset okay offset now okay how it's work i will go here to family type i will give it like a meter 500 mil or 1500 millimeter like that et voila okay you see easy now i will connect the dot okay i select this one and i connect i select this one with this one and i connect this one and this one and i connect this one with this one and i connect now i have this rectangle okay i can click on tab and make them a reference here okay you know the idea okay now i have this shape okay i can for example just test it i will select both and i make a form okay now i have this form i will load it in load it here in the project and you see this is the project that i have i show you that in the beginning that i select the shape here and i go for the family i just load it okay this family for now now i have this shape nothing extraordinary okay just that shape okay i will get back i click i point my here hover over and i click edit family and i get back okay nothing magical just a simple a box okay i will delete that one okay now i have this shape i go here and i go from the middle here to the middle here okay and i click on modify to escape now i will click on the 
point reference here, okay? And I get to the middle here and skip a couple of time. Now I will select this point with this point here and I connect the dot, okay? The same thing, I will select this one here with this one here and I connect the dot, okay? It's left only two. I select this one with this one here and I connect the dot. And I select this one here with this one here and I connect that. Now I can make them like a reference as a reference line, okay? Is a reference line, okay? Now I have this shape here. I will add here a small circle to perform my sweep. I will go here, a point. I will add a point here, another one, or escape. I will copy it. I don't need to create it multiple time. I go here for circle. I click on set. And now I set this work plan. And now I put like 70 or 80 millimeter. And now I got this circle. I will copy it by selecting, I copy it by selecting my point here. Okay, I have like three, I need maybe four. Okay, now I have like four. I will select here both. I will select the point, sorry. And I pick a new host, this one. Okay, I select this one here and pick new host this one okay now i have this one that i will sweep it along here and this one and i don't need this one and this one or this one okay i will select this one and my path here and the path here and i will go for solid okay maybe this you need more care but uh, we want just to got the idea for that select this one this one and my sorry and i go here for create a form now i have this shape now i will create for here this rectangle okay now i think we are ready to load it i just make shade here load into project i load it in my project now i select here my roof i go for here the family four okay the family one it is already done in the beginning et voila now i have the shape that we saw in the beginning this is how you create a space frame in a Revit. And don't forget to subscribe to our 5-Minute Revit channel to get the latest video to increase your productivity. Have a nice day. Thank you.